Hello and welcome to another update video about Matic. Matic is still fighting here with the golden ratio level at 41.3 cents. This 61.8 retracement there, um, which the price reached on Friday. We still can only identify a three wave rally and the price did react to our resistance area after trying to break out above the trend line. Well, you could argue it was a breakout, but not a sustainable one. It was a breakout because the market moved from 45 cents all the way up to 56, 57. Nothing major in crypto, but good for an intraday trade or a short term swing trade after the breakout. Now we've come back into support, but it's not support for an upside impulse. It's only support at best. I mean, really the best scenario I can see here um, from a bullish point of view at the moment yeah, is this larger ABC structure. Can't see anything more bullish because this is a three wave rally. The move down, to be honest, looks a bit impulsive. So that's already speculative, yeah, to watch here for a larger ABC structure as possible. So the 37.7 cent level in this case would be the key pivot that distinguishes between a possible C wave rally in wave four and another move down. I've, 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 you know, I've, I would find this support area, it, it's quite weak. It is very weak. So I actually can take out the trend line as well. We don't need that trend line anymore. It is simply a three wave rally. So what we want to talk about what would it look like if this um, wave four was playing out, first of all? Okay, so if this wave four, a larger wave four is playing out, which by the way would still lead to another low. You can see that better here on the larger time frame. So we could easily get another low in wave five, absolutely. Um, especially as long as the rally is in three waves and stays below 77.8 cents. In this case, the C wave to the upside would be a five wave move. One, two, three, four, five. The one, two setup would be an initial uh, confirmation that the C wave has started. So then the third wave would be the longest element. However, the three wave rally makes it much, or well, let's say makes it very likely that we've not completed the entire correction here anyway. So we could even be in an extension of the third wave any new low, and I would rule out the white count completely. Um, white count is still alive, technically. You know, we could have bottomed in the larger wave too, in a bullish perspective, because we're still holding above the June 22 low, which is the invalidation point. But then the move up would have to be some kind of a diagonal and it's highly speculative. But again, the 37.7 cent level distinguishes between short-term bullish, which could develop into something more bullish, or bearish and a break below 37.7 could indicate rather that we are still in the third wave then with support at 32 cents 29 27.4 and 21 cents this would be the direct pathway to the downside for now i leave it open you know i'm definitely considering that the wave four might have started already but in that case the third wave to the downside would have been quite weak you know it, it would be quite um yeah, it would just be quite weak, right? And and any further extension would likely just be this, that we had a B wave rally and we get just one more low in wave C. But the correct labeling here or the just relabeling everything isn't so important. Um, if you understand that 37.7 .7 cents is the pivot between short-term bullish and short-term bearish momentum, and that is quite likely that we get a break of support. So unfortunately, not anything clearly bullish here right now. If there is a reaction early in the week to the upside, I would first watch here for a C wave rally. That's the update about um, Matic. Have, hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Also make sure that you follow us on Instagram and Twitter for additional content. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.